thoughts that I feel Never before was I one to follow I question myself for the answers that heal and That's how it goes Ever feel like you're back in high school? Thanks. Phil, well, that was interesting. Yeah. I guess funerals always are. <laughs> yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. I'm tired. You know. you know, I can just grab the trash on my way out. No, I... Hey, uh, have a glass of wine with me here. Yeah. Wait. She's not gonna think I'm coming on to her, is she? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Cause I'm not. I'm, I'm, I just wanted to have a glass of wine. So where's Missy? Oh, she crashed out like 20 minutes ago. She's really tired. Hmm. Is this the good wine or the bad wine? You know, Tad really cares about you. I mean, he was so emotional tonight. Thank you. Did everybody show up at the funeral? No, just Tad and Travis and Jonesy. Yeah, I like Jonesy. Yeah. She's smart and she's honest. She's standing real close to me. Oh, right, well, I should ask her something. What am I gonna do about Travis and Missy? Oh, I, I don't think I should be the one to give advice on this. <laughs> hey, you're the fixer-upper. I mean, uh. say something, anything. I'm tired and dry. Maybe you should just let it be. I mean, maybe it's the forbidden that keeps it exciting, and after a while, it'll just fizzle up. I kind of remember yeah, forbidden, right. exciting things. Or maybe they'll be forever in love and I'm completely wrong. <laughs> it's the real deal. <laughs> hey, you made me laugh. Yeah, the real deal. Mm. You ever have that? The real deal? What? I'm, I'm just making conversation. I thought so once. Yeah. Mm. Oh, but I was young and, you know, it ended up being the raw deal. Tell me about it. Oh, God, it's not worth repeating. You always do that. See, that's what you always do, isn't it? You deflect or, and, and you diminish yourself. Why is that? Is that because you got hurt so bad? No, I just like focusing on other things, other people. Taking care of them, keeping myself clean. There's a reason someone as pretty as you is still alone. You're a beautiful woman, Denise, and you shouldn't be alone. Now you're going to think I'm coming on to you. I'm not... I. Am I? You're alone. Yeah, it's just because people keep dying on me. <laughs> I wasn't always. And I got missing. Ah, oh, well, I think I've had enough. I have an early court date with Travis in the morning. Right, fake ID. Right. Well, they'll just slap him on the wrist and fine him. We got the judge that we wanted. Old friend of Sylvester's. Big surprise. <laughs> the almighty Delberts and their almighty power. Almighty, all powerful. Almighty alrighty then, what the heck was I thinking? You know, I'll let you go this time, but one of these days I'll get that story out of you. What does that mean? Mm, not if I can help it. <laughs> I'm a pretty persuasive guy. You're coming on to her! You're coming on to her! <sighs> Thanks, Denise. Oh, I know how upset you were and how much you loved your mom and him. Yeah, thanks for that, but also just thanks for everything. I, I, I really appreciate the help, and you're right, I wouldn't have made it without you. See, that's what it is. I respect you as a co-worker and as a, a good person. Well, you can thank your dad for that. <laughs> oh, good night, Jeremy. That was weird. Oh, uh, for a minute there, I was thinking that I might actually have... Ooh. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> awkward girl, awkward moments. <laughs> Oh my god, what was I thinking? Ooh. <laughs>